Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Vijay, and I'm going to show you how to add another SSH key to an EC2 instance in just a few steps. You need this sometime when you are using another computer or when you have lost your SSH key and you want to do um, remote um, access from your laptop, or you know, it can be a different use case. In my case, I changed my laptop and I was not able to log into my instance. And I thought, why not make a video? So without wasting any time, let's get into this. On my screen, as you can see, there's a one instance I've selected. This instance has a key, uh, VJ personal account key. And we will use, we will add another key to this instance. Right, so on the left-hand side, uh, within, under the, S, um, the AWS console, S, um, uh, each two, you will see key pairs. On the right hand side, on the top, you will create 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 key pair. I will give any name, for example, new demo key, and I will use dot pam. Once you create this, you will see it has downloaded a new demo key into my computer. Now we're gonna use this spam tree to create a public key. I'm using Windows laptop, and so I'm going to use command prompt. It has download, downloaded the key to my download folder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to write a command, ssh as key gen minus y and f and the key name, which is new demo key. dot okay. so it has given us a new public key i'm going to select this and copy it we're going to need this later on now i go back to console and my instance i will connect my instance using ssm Taking a bit long. Right, so it has um, launched instance. Now, because I'm not seeing any user, I will just log into user to log into user, or um, this probably right now I'm in the, yeah, it's a SSM agent um, user account. So I have, I will switch my user to Ubuntu or EC2 instance. So let's see, so do I see you? That's Ubuntu. Now here I'm going to write a command which will um, add this uh, public key to my SSH folder. Now paste your copied public key. Now we're going to use this sign which is greater than sign, double greater, greater than sign. And I will give the path to the file dot ssh authorized keys it has successfully added this key to our uh, authorized key file under ssh folder now to verify i only had one uh, key inside it and if i have to verify cat um up to cd actually cd dot ssh and then i will do the cat authorized keys and it's wrong so i think i have made some mistake in the spelling yeah so there was a one SS, ssh key and i have added one more now to test it in real world i will again go back to command prompt and i will write ssh i i have to just find out my and the key location, and which can be anything. So new demo key dot pam. Sometimes it can be a different folder. So for example, if you are in users folder, you might have to do like this. Uh, D colon vgen colon downloads. So you got my idea because, but already in the download folder, I don't need to give this. And 
this is at what my instance public IP. Okay, so this need to be in the code. And I copied this. And as you can see, I have logged into my uh, instance from my laptop. And I can also again verify message and cat authorize keys. So there's a second key. Hope it helps. If you have any question, please ask me. And thank you for watching.